Welcome interns. I want to thank you for your help today. Do you guys know Jill Firestone? She's one of the people that comes up with ideas for the show. Hi. And Jill comes up with a lot of ideas. Some of the adjectives I've attached to them are ludicrous, unusable, crazy. So these are ideas that I have rejected. That this is pending. These are right, pending we'll ideas. Let you know which ones have been outright rejected, but you five will determine which ideas our brainstormer Jill Firestone actually gets into action this year. First, I wanted to talk to you guys about an idea called uh, fashion, also known as fruit skin fashion. Could you actually peel one of these? Sorry, okay, just peel it. Try to keep the skins intact because you're going to be using them for clothing, right? So it's like this, and then like maybe you have like a wristwatch. This could be like a little cap. Like what if they had to do physical challenges? Like if it falls off, then you're naked. Great. So Joe, why don't maybe you step out there um, beyond that glass door so you can see us but not hear us, and then I'll wave you back in after we've discussed this. How would you feel about watching that? It's impractical, but I'd like to see it on TV. Does fusion allow nudity? A lot of the fruit would fall off, I feel like. It's a great logistical question. Joe, do you want to come back in? What's our next idea? Every TV show has pranks. You know what I mean? This is using only fruit. We start the episode off with a slip of a banana peel, and people are like, this is a comedy show. I've seen this before. And then, splat, fruit smash, fruit pranks. F-R-O-T-P-R-A-N-X. So you're, you pick up this, you expect this. What if there was a fake finger? Or like some thing where like, what? This Joe, I think that's enough. Maybe you can step outside so we can talk about <laughs> fruit pranks. How do you guys feel about Joe's assertion at the top of that pitch that, quote, every TV show has pranks? I like pranking people, but why does it just have to be fruit? I thought I would never say this, but I would rather watch Fox News than watch that. I think we've discussed fruit pranks enough. Joe, do you want to come back in? Oh, I don't my Definitely not the people in the back row. Do you guys want to? Joe? You guys want to pursue careers in comedy? Or He's what? Joe. <laughs> so you, you can't be making threats like that, okay? Nobody has done this before on television. So Will Miles is going to try beef and broccoli from every Chinese food restaurant in the city. How many Chinese restaurants are there roughly? There's around 4,000. And then I want you guys all to picture this happening. 4,000 times for a while. <laughs> How many of you guys would advise that we do two beef, two broccoli on this show? There's no way in hell you have the budget for 4,000 things of takeout. Great point. 599, 598, 597, 596, 595. Spicy jigglies. This is something actually that I've been trying to pitch for... Two years. Two years now. How fun is Jello? Very fun. fun. Yeah, it's fun. fun. How crazy do spices taste? Super crazy. What if we stir in different spices in different jello? First one, do garlic salt. Okay, you're gonna eat that. Guess what it is? <laughs> Seems like you guys, from what I saw, enjoyed spicy jigglies. True, false? True. False. It just seems like fucked up. This next idea is called uh, Welp. We get turned into pretzel. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone know what a pretzel is? Yes. Drew is going to take off all his clothes. Clearly, a human body is going to be more of a soft pretzel than a hard pretzel. Soft pretzels use butter. and then push your hand directly. Yeah, that's it. I got his hair on my hand. Man. Twist his arms, and then you say, Well, I've got turned into a pretzel. Okay, Joe, please step outside. Drew, thank you so much. Does anyone have any thoughts about, Well, I've been turned into a pretzel? I love it. You love it? If it's like a summer rooftop party episode. 10 out of 10. The whole experience was slightly erotic. Okay, Joe, you want to come back in? It's coming down to either spicy jigglies or, Well, I've been turned into a pretzel. I do think that spicy jigglies is something that could change television. Anyone willing to give Joe that chance? Who would like to vote for spicy jigglies? Joe, it looks like after two full years, you're finally going to get a chance to do spicy jigglies. Which episode do you think we're going to do? I don't know if it'll be an episode. I it'll it, probably uh, be a web exclusive. That's fine. <laughs>